Hey guys, Thunderbow here. Today I'm bringing you a tutorial on how to stop the effective power text for iPhone users. So first, what is the effective power text? Well, the effective power text is basically a line of text that you can send to anyone with an iPhone running iOS 8. And basically, uh, it's a bug in iOS's ability to decode Unicode. And this particular string of text, um, when sent to an iPhone, um, you get a notification banner on the top of your phone, and for some reason, iOS can't depict that particular string and translate into Unicode, which is what the iPhone does, like, that's basically what the iPhone reads. And it can't do that. It's a bug with Unicode. And, um, since it can't read it, what it does is it just crashes your entire phone. And a lot of people have been using this uh, effective power text for uh, malicious purposes and just to mess around with their friends who have iPhones. Uh, I have actually been sent the effective power text multiple times and it is really annoying. And there is a quick solution to fix it. And I'm just going to demonstrate what the effective power text does. So here I have my iPhone. Uh, it's unlocked, you know. Uh, I have my text messages up here, which I am not going to open the app. But uh, what will happen when after I text myself, the effective of power message, um, my phone will crash. Now, right now, I am using my iPod to send myself the effective power text, and um, so I'm just going to tap send now and watch as my iPhone crashes. So it's sending, and my phone just crashed. So that's basically what the effective power does. It's a really, really annoying bug, and there is a quick and simple fix for it. So once my phone reboots, I will show you guys how to stop effective power. Alright, so this is how you stop the effective power text. First, open up your iPhone settings app. Now scroll down to where you see notifications. Open up the notifications and scroll down till you see messages. Tap on messages and most solutions that I've seen, at least online, say to switch allow notifications to off. However, that will stop your phone from buzzing when you get a text. Only turn off allow notifications if you don't mind your phone not buzzing. Um, I like my phone buzzing whenever I receive texts and just allowing notifications I believe will also stop the chime so you won't even know when you get a text. So in order to still get a chime and a text, like a, a vibration when you get a text, scroll down until you see uh, alert style when unlocked. It should be on banners by default. Tap none. And then directly above it, it says show on lock screen. Turn that off as well. If you get the effective power text and your phone is on and it's on the lock screen, like you just turn your phone off, let's just say your phone is off right now and you turn your phone back on. Um, if I get a text while my lock screen is activated, then it will crash my phone. So obviously, you don't want that to happen. So disable show on lock screen as well. So with these two things disabled, you will still be able to receive a text tone as well as a buzz. Uh, so that way, you still know when you get texts, they just won't show up on your phone, and you'll have to manually go into the Messages app and see all your texts. So as of now, Apple has officially recognized that this bug is like this prominent thing and it has to be fixed immediately, and they are actually working on a solution right now, so hopefully within a few days to a week, there will be a iOS 8 update that will... Uh, finally stop the effective power text. However, right now this is just a temporary solution and hopefully, uh, you know, we don't have to worry about the effective power text anymore. Anyway, if you guys found this tutorial helpful, be sure to drop a like on this video. Also, subscribe for more videos. Share this video on Facebook, Twitter, and Google Plus to spread the word about my channel and I will see you guys in the next video.